Hello everyone. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're traveling back in time to the age of dinosaurs. From the ferocious Tyrannosaurus rex to the armored Ankylosaurus, we're exploring the lives of some of the most famous dinosaurs that once roamed our planet. Let's dive into the prehistoric world and uncover the fascinating details of these incredible creatures. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and ring the bell for more wildlife wonders. Let's get started. Tyrannosaurus Rex Tyrannosaurus Rex, or in short, the T-Rex, was one of the most feared predators of the late Cretaceous period. T-Rex had a massive skull balanced by a long, heavy tail, and could grow up to 40 feet in length. They lived in what is now North America, roaming forests and river valleys. Known for their powerful jaws, T-Rex could crush bones with their teeth, making them formidable hunters. Despite their fearsome reputation, some scientists believe they also scavenged for food. Their keen sense of smell helped them locate prey and carrion from great distances. Triceratops Triceratops are easily recognizable by its three horns and large bony frill. These herbivores lived during the late Cretaceous period in North America. Triceratops could grow up to 30 feet long and weigh up to 12 tons. Their horns were likely used for defense against predators like T-Rex and possibly in mating displays. These dinosaurs traveled in herds, grazing on low-lying vegetation. The frill might have also been used to regulate their body temperature. Stegosaurus The Stegosaurus is known for the distinctive plates along its back and the spikes on its tail, called the Thagomizer. Living during the late Jurassic period, they were found in what is now North America. Stegosaurus could reach up to 30 feet in length, with a tiny brain compared to its body size. The plates may have been used for display, thermoregulation, or protection. Despite their intimidating appearance, Stegosaurus was a slow-moving herbivore. They likely used their tail spikes to defend against predators like Allosaurus. Velociraptor Velociraptors were small but fierce predators, about the size of a turkey with feathers and a sickle-shaped claw on each foot. They lived during the late Cretaceous period in what is now Mongolia. Velociraptors were swift and agile hunters, using their claws to slash at prey. Contrary to their depiction in movies, they were likely covered in feathers and may have hunted in packs. Their intelligence and speed made them effective predators. Fossils indicate they may have preyed on small dinosaurs and even scavenged larger carcasses. Brachiosaurus Brachiosaurus, one of the tallest dinosaurs, had long necks that allowed them to reach vegetation high in the trees. They lived during the late Jurassic period in North America and Africa. Brachiosaurus could grow up to 85 feet long and weigh up to 50 tons. Unlike other sauropods, their front legs were longer than their hind legs, giving them a giraffe-like posture. These gentle giants likely traveled in herds, foraging for leaves and branches. Their large nasal openings on top of their heads might have helped them breathe while feeding high in the trees. Apatosaurus Apatosaurus, formerly known as Brontosaurus, was a massive sauropod with a long neck and whip-like tail. They roamed North America during the late Jurassic period. Apatosaurus could reach lengths of up to 75 feet and weigh around 20 tons. They likely used their long necks to feed on vegetation in a wide radius without moving much. These herbivores lived in herds and were among the largest animals to ever walk the earth. Their powerful tails could have been used as a defense mechanism against predators. Spinosaurus Spinosaurus was one of the largest carnivorous dinosaurs, known for the distinctive sail-like structure on its back. They lived during the Cretaceous period in what is now North Africa. Spinosaurus could grow over 50 feet long and weigh up to 20 tons. They were semi-aquatic, hunting for fish and possibly swimming in rivers and lakes. The sail might have been used for display, thermoregulation, or even as a means to help them swim. Recent studies suggest that Spinosaurus spent much of its time in water, similar to modern crocodiles. Dilophosaurus Dilophosaurus, known for the crests on its head, was an early Jurassic predator. 
They lived in what is now North America, and their name means, two-crested lizard. Dilophosaurus could grow up to 20 feet long and had a slender build. The crests might have been used for display or species recognition. Contrary to popular belief, there is no evidence they could spit venom as depicted in movies. Their lightweight build suggests they were agile and fast runners, preying on smaller animals. Ankylosaurus Ankylosaurus was an armored dinosaur with bony plates covering its body and a large club at the end of its tail. They lived during the late Cretaceous period in North America. Ankylosaurus could grow up to 25 feet long and weigh around 6 tons. Their armor and tail club were used to defend against predators. These herbivores fed on low-lying plants and had a robust, low-slung body built for protection. Fossil evidence suggests they may have lived in herds for added protection. Allosaurus Allosaurus was a formidable predator that lived during the late Jurassic period in North America. They could grow up to 40 feet long and had sharp, serrated teeth for tearing flesh. Allosaurus was likely an apex predator, hunting large herbivorous dinosaurs like Stegosaurus. They had strong legs and a flexible neck, aiding in their hunting strategies. Fossils suggest they may have hunted in packs or at least scavenged together. Their claws and teeth were well adapted for slicing through the flesh of their prey. Thank you for being a part of our journey through the prehistoric world today to explore these remarkable creatures. Dinosaurs were truly diverse and fascinating creatures, each with their unique adaptations and behaviors. We hope you found them as intriguing and mesmerizing as we do. It is your support that keeps us going. So, if you loved this video, and want go on more such adventures, make sure to hit that subscribe button below. Don't forget to give us a big thumbs up and share it with your friends too. Nature is full of surprises, so keep your eyes wide open and your heart ready for more thrilling discoveries. We will be back with more animals in our next video.